Hello, everybody. Hello, my friends. My name is Stephanie Burchot. I'm a spiritual certified coach. I am an energy healer, and I am all about tapping tapping queen, as I like to say. So today's tapping session is all about connecting with your intuition. If you're feeling stuck, if you're feeling unsure um, of what to do, next steps in your life, if you're feeling lost, this tapping is going to be so powerful for that because we always want to connect with our intuition before taking action, whether it's a big step, a smaller step. Being in alignment with your intuition allows you to take action, not from a place of fear, not from a place of like, you know, um, anxiety or overwhelm, but from a place that is alignment with yourself, with your higher self. And from that place, we get to have the most fun in life, um, live with the most joy, do things that are actually best for our best and highest good. If you have not watched the intro tapping video, go do that. It was also in the same uh, place where you downloaded this from. So take advantage of that. I'll do a quick little, you know, minute or two tapping 101, but uh, check out that intro video because I go a little bit more in depth into everything. So with tapping, the way it works is I'm going to start and you're going to repeat after me, right? Ideally repeat out loud, but if you can, you can also repeat in your head. Um, if you are if you know the tapping points, you can gently close your eyes, but you can also keep them open, whatever feels more comfortable to you. Um, remember, you may yawn, you may have, you know, tear release, you may have a smile, whatever it feels like, just allow yourself to feel it because that's the energy moving. And um, what else? Take a big glass of water, take a huge sip. I just guzzle a bunch of water um, because you want to be well hydrated for this. And uh, the points, just quickly, we're going to start karate chop point. This is a gentle pressure, right? This is the pressure of like if you're tapping somebody that, you know, you're trying to get their attention, like, hey, excuse me, right? Like a little, hey, excuse me. It's that little gentle of a tap. So we always start karate chop points, then top of the eyebrow. You can do right, left, both side of the eyebrow right at the end of your eyebrow then this little bone below the eye top of the lip chin collarbone right below the collarbone right here uh you know side of the body right here your your why can i think of these bones Wow, my mind just went blank. You know what I'm talking about? Right here, side of the body, top of the head. Rib cage. Thank you. Um, okay, I think that's it. Let's um, let's begin. One last thing. You're changing the points after every sentence, right? If you want to keep your eyes closed or you can always follow along. So turn, let's just take a gentle breath in together. <sighs> Exhale out. And just connect with your breath. If you wanna welcome energy in, you can gently place your hands, palms face up. If you kinda of wanna close and get comfy and cozy with your energy, just palms facing down. Just connect with yourself. Where are you right now? Just be present. Gently place your feet on the ground. Wiggle your toes. This tapping round is about connecting with your intuition. If you're feeling stuck or lost or unsure, we're going to connect with your intuition. As for getting started, remember that the first couple rounds that I'll do are talking about the thing that feels uncomfortable, right? So allow yourself to feel that discomfort. Allow yourself to be uncomfortable and trust that your body is releasing and letting go exactly what's meant for you to let go. In the last few rounds, it'll be about reprogramming your subconscious, reprogramming your beliefs and really connecting with your intuition. So that's a little bit of how this goes. So if you think on a scale from one to 10, 10 
I am so disconnected from my intuition, right? I don't know what to do. It's hard for me to make a decision. I feel really uncomfortable right now because I feel like I, I'm lost. One is I'm super connected with my intuition. I am so aligned. Life is great. I know exactly what to do and what actions to take. Where are you right now on that scale? Just take a couple seconds. Okay, and whatever you are, we're still loving ourselves. Just take a gentle breath in. If you feel comfortable, you can gently close your eyes. And starting side of our hands, this karate chop point. Just gently repeat after me. Even though I'm not feeling super connected with my intuition. I fully love and support myself. Even though I wish I was more connected with my intuition. I wish I could hear my higher self better. I still love myself. Even though I'm feeling stuck and a little bit lost in my life. I deeply and completely love myself. For the first round, I'll repeat the points and then we're just gonna tap along. So top of the eyebrow. I'm feeling uncomfortable in my life right now. Side of the eyebrow. There are a lot of things that feel off. Bottom of the eyebrow. I'm feeling stuck in a lot of ways. Top of the lip. Like I'm going around on this conveyor belt not knowing what to do. Chin. And I am a grown ass adult. Chest. Shouldn't it be easier by now? Side of the body. Shouldn't I just be successful at life? Top of the head. And yet here I am, not knowing what to do. Here I am knowing that I could be doing so much better. I feel like I'm judging myself. I have all this pressure on me. all these things that I want to accomplish. And yet I'm feeling stuck. Yes, I have all these dreams. I have all of these desires. I have all of these wants. I'm so lost. I feel so scared. I can't listen to my intuition. Most things feel really foggy right now. Part of me, I just wish I was on a path. And I know what I want. I know that I can do it. 
I know I can have the relationship, the career, the financial abundance, amazing friends, loving family. And yet I'm completely paralyzed. It's like Groundhog's Day, day after day. And I wanna fucking scream so loud. I want somebody to pull me out of this conveyor belt. I mean, there are a lot of things that are great with my life. But the big things, I'm so stuck. I am so lost. Am I ever going to get to where I want to get? Or is it going to feel like I'm feeling today for the rest of my life? Keep breathing, you're doing beautiful, you're doing wonderful. Just keep breathing through the feelings. Are my dreams ever gonna come a reality? I wish I knew the answer for sure. And I'm kind of ready to take action. because I'm feeling a little complacent. Just like, uh. I mean, sure, there are some highs in my life where I feel really good. But then there are those lows where I'm up all night, staring at the ceiling wondering what the hell is going on. Someone gonna pull me out of this hole. Am I capable of changing my life around? And I don't know, I don't know if I am. I know I'm a great person. I know that I am loving. I know that I have the best intentions. I know that I'm really damn smart. I know I can make things happen. I've done it before. So in this moment, while I'm tapping with Stephanie. I might as well check in, truly check in, see what's going on. And I just want you to pick a point and stop the tapping for, for a couple of minutes and pick a point from all of the tapping points and just gently apply a gentle pressure. You're not tapping, you're just gently applying pressure. And just gently close your eyes. Do a little body scan. Maybe it's your chest or your belly, your shoulders. Maybe it's your left knee or your right ankle. Just see which area in your body feels a little bit heavier, a little stressed, a little anxious. You feel discomfort energetically and maybe even physically. For me, it's my belly. Now, wherever you feel that place in your body that you pick that feels a little bit heavier, 
bring your attention to that place. And just say hello. So for me, it's, hey, belly. I love you. Be hey, ankle, hey, ear. Just loving on your body. Hey, body, I love you. And just gently tell your body, thank you for showing me. Thank you for the discomfort. And then say, I know I've been avoiding you lately. I'm getting mad at you. Pretending you don't exist. But I'm here now. And I know you exist. And I am so sorry I was running away from you. I'm ready to love you and accept you and honor you. To see what reaction you get from that body part. You might feel something right away. You may not, it's okay, just trust. You're giving yourself the love that you need it. I want you to ask that body part, what is it trying to tell you? So for me, it's, hey, belly, I feel you being uncomfortable. And I love to hear how I can bring comfort and love to you. Trust that whatever message came up is exactly what you, what you needed to hear. My belly said, Steph, keep resting, keep, keep thinking, keep taking things easy. Trust that it's all coming together for you. Okay. No matter what the message is for you, say, thank you, belly. Thank you, body part. And at this, this point, you should begin to feel a little bit more lightness, a little bit more ease in the body and the mind. Now bring your attention to that space in between your eyebrows right here. This is your third eye chakra, represent your intuition, connecting to your highest self, right? Maybe visualize a nice little circle, just the space gentle right here. Keep your hand in whatever pressure point you had it. Keep your eyes closed. Just bring your attention to that space, focus in that space right in between your eyebrows and your forehead right around there. And just gently repeat after me. Hey, intuition. I miss you. Take a couple of seconds to share with your intuition how you've been feeling. I've been feeling lonely. I've been feeling stuck. I've been feeling powerful and confident. However you're feeling, share with your intuition.
let your intuition know I've been wanting to reconnect with you, to have you present in my life, to help me make decisions that are in alignment with you. Will you help me? You might immediately hear a yes or a huh. Maybe you're not hearing anything yet and that's also okay. I want you to tell your intuition where you're feeling lost. Hey, intuition, I've been feeling really lost in my career. I'd like some help. Or it can be very specific. Hey, intuition, I'm about to launch this new program and I'm not really sure all the content that I need for it to be awesome. Or hey, intuition, should I move to this new city or not? Anything. Just gently share with your intuition the question you have in mind that you wish you solved, that you wish you already had the solution to. beautiful. Now you may get the answer right away. And if you don't, now this question has been officially asked to the universe, to your intuition, and your job and your responsibility is to stay with eyes and arms and ears and nose and body wide open. And know that the answer is on its way. Now stay curious and excited. Where am I going to get it? Where am I going to get it? Where is it going to come from? A song, a human, conversation, a movie. Answers are on my way to me right now. Now say thank you, intuition, for guiding me, for showing me the way. I am ready and open for miracles and solutions. Solutions and miracles are on its way to me right now. Before we continue with a round of tapping to wrap up with your intuition, say thank you for being in my life. Thank you for the guidance. Let's just take a gentle breath in. <sighs> Exhale out. Just do a couple more rounds. Top of the eyebrow. I'm beginning to feel really good right now. I know that the answers are on their way to me. I was able to connect with my intuition. And that felt really energizing. Now I know that at any point during the day or any time I feel lost, I can connect with my intuition. I can just gently close my eyes and say hello to my intuition and ask for anything I need. I trust that I'm always being guided. I trust that I am safe. 
I trust that miracles and solutions are always on its way to me. I trust in myself. I trust in my decisions. We trust that everything is always working out for me. I am love. I am light. I am trust. I am safe. I got this. I am okay and I am on my way. I am joy. I am light. I am love. And let's just take a gentle breath in, exhale out. Feel that energy moving. And shifting. And let's just take a gentle breath in. Exhale all the way out. Whenever you're ready, you may open your eyes. Let's do a quick little check-in. When we started, I asked you to rate yourself, right? 10, feeling so disconnected and so overwhelmed and so stuck. And one, you know, I'm so aligned, I'm so connected, I'm so in flow with my intuition. So now we're here again, check in again with that rating. How are you feeling now? The numbers stay the same, that it go lower. For most of you, if not for all of you, it definitely decreased, meaning you feel more connected and more aligned with your intuition. And this is a recording that you can go back to as many times as you need and connect and do. It, it took us you know, less than 20 minutes you can do this every day and keep connecting with your intuition. I hope you so enjoyed this. Know that tapping is always available to you. If you have any more questions, you wanna know more about what I'm doing, the latest and greatest, you can always go to stephanieverschow.com and find all the things out. It has been a pleasure to do this tapping together. And remember to always, follow your joy. Have an incredible rest of your day, your week, your month, your life, and um, let's stay connected. Thank you for joining me and uh, enjoy this delicious feeling after a beautiful tapping session. Take care.